What is up guys, Zack Scott here, playing The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Last time you checked in, we went underground, we got auto build, we fought against Master Koga. This time I'm going to talk to Robbie, see what he wants, because he wants to go to another place. I know that. I really appreciate you fixing up my balloon. Ultra thanks. And by the way, ultra thanks to you guys. You guys left over 17,000 likes on the first episode already. It has over half a million views. Thank you for your support. That auto build thing is pretty darn amazing. Hmm, I should have a good think about all the practical uses of that someday. Oh, that reminds me. Hey you, listen up. Now that Josh has solved the mystery of that slate, I can return to the, to the Purapad Laboratory in Hateno Village. If you go there, I can make even more improvements to your Purapad, starting with the sensor. You'll find the lab in East Nakluda, off the southeast corner of Hyrule. It's on the far side, uh, on its far side is Hateno Village. Go a bit farther than that and you'll see a mighty peculiar place. Don't let the looks fool you, it's cutting edge. It's a cutting edge lab. People have been saying the princess has been sighted in the castle, but I have a hard time believing that. Anyway, Pyrrha's on top of that. She'll be looking into the castle herself. I intend to look for clues regarding the princesses, re regarding the princess using my own methods. All right, I'm going to head over there. I'll be waiting for you to arrive. See you in, in Hateno Village. Don't keep me waiting. So I don't know if I'm gonna to go to Hateno Village <laughs> right now because it's kind of far off and we may not make it all the way, but I'm gonna head that direction and uh, kind of see what needs to happen. Um, there's a few other side quests that I can do. By the way, I scanned, I got some more swords yesterday. There's some, uh, and, and I, I, also, I also talked and got some more shield slots. I also talked to, uh, uh, what's his face? The Korok, the big Hestu, I talked to him. So, if if we take a look at uh, the objectives here, I think over this way is the Hateno area, I think. I um, don't really remember. But I bet you I'll be able to find it if I go to, you know, one of these uh, one of these Skyview Towers and try to get to the next Skyview Tower from there. So, let's see if that's even going to be possible. Let's look at the adventure log. And uh, Hateno Village Research Lab. If we mark it... It's not that far, really. I mean, it, it looks kind of far. <laughs> How far does it look? It's right over here. It is far. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. I don't know if I'll make it all the way over there today. But uh, there, is, there are some things to do. I, there's a there's a shrine there I could do. There's a shrine here. There's a shrine. There's a, Obviously, Misko's treasure needs to be done as well. That shouldn't take too long to do if we just get over here. Um, let's finish up some shrines around here there's a bunch of shrines left in this central area that we could probably try to pull off before we move on um i don't know there's three it looks like but uh we had an exciting episode yesterday auto build is going to be something that i really am excited about i'm going to look forward to i need to upgrade my battery today that's one thing i can do that would be really really helpful especially if i'm going to be traveling by vehicles um uh, this is what i know i can get a really cool weapon here if i just take any of these really I could take, let's take one of uh, these, this Claymore, equip it, and then we're gonna turn on the fuse, because I'm gonna go over here, and I'm just gonna straight up uh, steal this. Ow, hey, hey, stop it now. Stop it now, thank you. <laughs> They're all over, they're all over, help! Uh, and then, that'll be a useful little item, and then I'm just gonna jump up here. Let's go. And I'm actually going up pretty high, uh, higher than I, I probably want to. So where are the shrines that we've marked? They're all over here, aren't they? Can I see them from here? Which way is which way am I facing right now? Yeah, just that way. So yeah, there's like one, two. Oh, that was underground. I can remove that. There's one over here? What, what did I mark over here? There's another uh, chasm entrance over there too. The main thing I think is the shrine. That's what I really want to do is the shrine over here. I wouldn't be surprised if I've actually gotten the, the light route under there. There's a lot of chasm entrances, aren't there? Dude, there's... I. I haven't been there lately. 
I could go take a look at that too today. I feel like I'm kind of going the wrong way, aren't I? No, I'm kind of going the right way. It'll just take forever to get over to Hatino or whatever. All right, shrine time, baby. We got this, and then there's also a. Uh, like a stronghold there. I don't know about that. It's raining. Oh, boy. The main thing is, you know, getting these shrines down, done. Ka Kamizun Shrine. Okay. So going in, getting this done. I mean, these are shrines that I, I mean, left nearby. I, I kind of skipped through them or past them. And it's so close. And I didn't even really do it, so. I don't know. Let's do them now. We're doing them now. I don't have clothes on. The shrine imprisons and purifies the ancient evil. So this is one where I got to fight these guys without anything except for what they give me. Which is fine because uh, they're going to give me enough stuff. Whoops. Finally hit one in the, the marker. Oh, then come up here. Okay, that, not, not exactly what I was trying to do. Ow. Dude, that doesn't hurt at all. Oh, I need a different weapon. Excuse me. Long stick, I know, I know. I'm going to heal after this, so... The spear, essentially. The weak, 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 weak ability. Let me pick that one up. <laughs> I just went hardcore at it. I didn't even really think my equipment. Yeah, get rid of this other stuff too, please. <laughs> I don't want this other stuff I just picked up. So that was pretty cool. I, I still have it, I think. I have like, two, I like, wait, I have two shields on? No, oh, that's my old shield, I, I guess, right? Uh, yeah, I'm fine. Okay, cool. Uh, let's see. There is a treasure here, of course. Oh, wow, look at this. Another one of these guys. These are useful. Um, do another soldier claymore. There you go. That was that one is strong. Why isn't that one as strong? It's a smaller ball. Interesting. All right, let's look for the treasure. There's just yeah, there's treasure just right here. Let's see what it gives me. Spring shield. That's awesome. A shield. Okay. I don't even know how that works or what that would do. But this is uh, that's the only treasure here. Yes, let's go. Now, one thing I'm curious about, if I were to fast travel back to the, um, the tower, would there be another one of those balls there? Would that be a quick way to just get more of these balls on my claymores? The big entrance there. But really, if we're going to go back in the depths, I'm, I'm going to be tracking down Master Koga again. I think. Uh, so I don't really want to do that right now. Let's see. I, I kind of, I'm kind of am curious. Well, hold on. There's Misko's treasure there, too. So if we fast travel here, I'm just curious if, if I can get another one of these big balls. Maybe just put it on like a regular sword instead of like one of the claymores. Could be interesting. Or it could be gone. I might have already absorbed it. You know what I mean? Like, I have to wait for the next blood moon or whatever. I don't know if that's the case. Yeah, it's gone. Wow. They're not going to be generous. But there's a shrine right across there. Yeah, let's skip this. We know what this looks like. It better not be storming. I see it right, right across the way. And I've, I have already been here, right? Double check. I have been here, I think. 
I haven't been to that that uh what was it called? I haven't been to that one area. Hold on, where's my map? I'm going towards the wrong spot. How did I do that? I don't know what I'm doing. So where's uh where's the treasure? Because that treasure would be a good thing to find. It's coming up. Where is it? I think it's down there. Oh, there's a shrine down there too. Let's go to this shrine. I think there's gonna be a treasure near it. Unless I'm unless I'm overshooting. Am I No, that's that's even earlier than the green mark that I have. There's two towers near here that would be good to unlock. Yeah, there's two shrines, so good deal. Some horses over here. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I don't want to mess with that guy right now. Where's the, uh, Here, let me just put a marker on it. Shock resistant outfit. Well, that's coming up. It's right up here. I'll be able to see it, I think. So, plus there being a shrine. Good, it's clearing up. I don't like the rain too much. Let's see. Let's see. It's gonna get to a point where I'm gonna. Oh wow! Hold on. I I think I've seen one of those before. I just haven't done one. One of those like big battle tanks. I think I ran away from the one last time. Anyway, let's do this shrine. Tinitin Shrine. We might get another heart soon. I think I'm going for another heart next and then maybe stamina after that. So I read in the comments that I can do the Zelda thing next. But I kind of want to do the Hitino Village thing next. Combat training throwing, okay. Let's throw, dude. Let's have a throw down. That's what they call him, right? Do I, I mean, they should have given me, hold on, what, what can I throw? He my instruction, okay, I will listen to your instructions. Just let me, let me go. <laughs> Set your aim and then throw the weapon at the enemy. Got it. Give me some weapons. Your other attacks are ineffective here. Ready yourself. I'm ready. <laughs> it's like ready. Get ready. Are you ready? I'm ready. Yeah, I know how to throw. All right, let me just grab one of these though, I guess. Ow. All right. Hold on. Uh, instead of that, here, let me. The problem here is okay. Rusty halberd. Easy. Well done. Now what? Yeah, watch the movements, throw the weapon, got it. These are all very fragile. Oh, that missed. There you go. There you go. I don't do that a lot, honestly. Maybe I could. Is there a treasure on the other side? See, like these shrines that I haven't done, I mean, I should have done them earlier, honestly, because they're so easy that it almost feels like, okay, I get it, how to throw a weapon, I know. I know how to throw a weapon. That's like, well, you haven't done this before. Like, I know. I know I haven't done it. Let's see, let's see what we got. A strong Zonite Spear, that's really cool. Um, let's ditch this sword that I just got. I guess it's cool. It may not be that cool. And we got the treasure, right? Yes, indeed. And then some clothes are up ahead, so we get to investigate a cave. All right. Let me out of here. This is two in a row since I last cashed in. If we do four shrines today, that's another heart. That's a good deal. 
but really, I think uh, I think we're going to be uh, we're already in a, in a good spot because I've done four of the temples, assuming there's only four. I don't know how many there are. I talk as if it's the end, but you know the next part of the game is not even the end. So uh, let's go get the clothes. If I want this spear to be really cool, I would probably take uh, I would probably sort by fuse power. And, uh, well, really, really, the Gibdo bones have such a... Oh, it breaks easily. I was like, they have such a huge fuse, but this would be great to put on a spear, like a throwing thing. Uh, but the Captain Construct, three horns, hold, and then drop. And then if I, yeah, if I want this, fuse. There you go. Who, is there a noise? Oh, it's a Korok. What are you doing here, buddy? I need to reach my friend. Where is he? Show me where he is. Uh, it's not that far, honestly. Yeah. Uh, but is this a car? Does this already have wheels? I didn't realize that these things had wheels. Somehow. Oh yeah, I did. Never mind. Or maybe I didn't. I don't know. The point is... What is this? I'm not... What, what is this? It's like a bomb. I'm, I am curious about this. Let's put you on the front. Doesn't weigh anything. It's even worse. Okay, hold on. What does this do? <laughs> Ow. <laughs> But he went flying. That was cool for him. It's kind of stuck here, though. It's okay. We'll uh, we'll make we'll make do with what we have. Is there wait, is there another shrine over there that I didn't see before? No, I've done that one. All right, can we just ride on this one? Uh, first up. Oh crap! Oh crap! I got it. <laughs> I was a little worried about that one. Oh, it's still going. Oh, no. Okay, it's done. I mean, a control stick would make all the difference here. It'd be like a legit car if I had a control stick for it. So the good news is that we are going to reach the friend right here. I might attack that place just for funsies. I've done this shrine though, right? Yeah. Right? Where, where are we on the map? Yeah. Yeah, I've done this one. Very recently, in fact. All right. Two Korok seeds. I think I need 12 total to expand my slots even more. Where's Riju? Probably my least favorite part of the game is I have to actually look at them and talk to them in order to activate anything. <laughs> All right. <laughs> the rest of them are like, what was that noise? I see him. <laughs> I mean, it's it's easy to do it like this. I don't know if there's going to be any like treasure here or not. <laughs> wow. 
That was devastating. Is that it though? I mean, is that all that there was? Maybe so, and that's okay. What are these squirrels doing? Riju, come here. We need to get some squirrels. <laughs> what are these squirrels up to? <laughs> I got one of them. <laughs> got a little nugget. Acorn. They just had an acorn? Where's this meat? I guess squirrels don't have enough meat. All right, let's go. I don't even know if there's anything up here for me. I just attacked because I was feeling vicious. Oh, I thought the moblin horn. Oh, shoot! Read you, read you, read you. We don't. We're not messing around. Read you. Come here. Okay, you're you're fine. What the heck? Okay, that works too. I don't think there's anything here. Oh, I got a roasted acorn. That's a brand new item. <laughs> Let's go up a little bit more. What's this? Nice. Bokoblin stuff. And, oh, there's a little treasure. Good deal. Sapphire. Great. So, we just did this shrine so we can fast travel to it. I don't have to walk. <laughs> oh, but I, I want to get those clothes, you know? I said it was shock protection, which... I'm trying to figure out when I would need that the most. During lightning storms. <laughs> Uh, the cave is over here. Let's find the entrance. So we can go in. My health is a little low, but, you know, it'll be fine. I can gobble down some apples or whatever. What is that over there? Okay. Where's this cave? Wait, did I walk all the way around? Did I miss the entrance? Was it just over here? Because the X looks like it's over here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, you know, but why? Why? Like, every time I'm looking for someone specifically. You know, but get over here, dude. <laughs> what the heck? Thank you. Don't walk through the fire. Discovery of a lifetime right here. Little bats. Peace. I know what they're called. Called keys. Keys eyeballs. Don't forget the wings. Apparently the wings make the... Uh, oh. Thank you. Someone else got them. Thank you. These little pests. Every time you come down here, you do get like bomb flowers and stuff. So that's pretty cool. Wait, did we go? Wait, what? What's this way? Okay, yeah, hey. You know both. Right down there. Ooh, even more stuff. Someone's like, what? Oh, what the heck is that? Whoa! Oh, shoot! Oh, God, got him. Ugh, scary. <laughs> My nightmare. Alright, then we have, uh, we have a good old cobble crusher. For rock salts, flints, all that stuff. I think I heard a lizard. Anything else that way? Something. I don't know. Do I have just a regular sword? Yeah. go. 
Where's your head? I got it, don't worry. Let's go back to cobble crushing. I don't even I don't even think I need to pick up their arms anymore. All right, good deal, good deal. And then up here, let's get my sword back. So not only have we not found the, the, the gear yet, we haven't found, what is the gear? Oh, this may not be the gear. What is this? Is, is this the gear? Normally I'm expecting like a nice little, oh, this is a shoulder shield, but it's durable, I guess. Okay, now I'm a little bit worried because I don't know where to go from here. Oh, over there. That'll be good. Or wait, hold on. Is that where we came from? No, we came from here, right? We also have to find the booball. I think it's Yiga Clan, by the way. I looked it up. The Zelda wiki says it's Yiga Clan. Uh, wait. <laughs> Wait a second. And then you. Okay, well, good job. Uh oh. I'm going down here. You know what? We don't even need to worry about that guy, do we? Oh, he's looking at me now. He's looking at me now. Show your little parts. Oh, ow. Send it back. Ow, you suck. When do we get to see? What's the deal? There's the answer. There's the answer we were looking for. It was covered in rocks, so we took away the rocks. They still shooting rocks, though. There you go. Uh, let's, uh, hold on. Weapon. Good thing we're doing this fast. Uh, here we go. Is it done for? Is it done for? Good. Oh, don't drop all this stuff down the hall. What the heck? Yep. I mean, how much do I need those like stones or whatever? I need to eat. Oh, I'm, I'm actually running a little low on my meats. Uh, Let's do cobble crusher on these guys. Actually, hey, you know, Bo. You know what's up. The problem with using a Nobo to, to mine stuff is it just flies everywhere, dude. Also, I think these bright blooms, he's got triggered instead of... If someone's like on the other side of this. Crap, that's the electricity, right? Now, I don't suppose the electric guy will be... Oh wow, good hit, good hit, good hit, good hit. Okay, hold on, no, no, switch weapons, please. Dang it. Oof, I'm in the water, I'm in the water. That's not a good place to be. Does anyone talk to me? Wow, okay. Does somebody, <laughs> somebody talk to me about this. Oh, that didn't do anything. There you go. Okay. Good. We got whatever we came here for. Some like stones or whatever. Soldiers, but that's a good one. That's a really good one. Let's ditch this uh, mighty construct bow. Let's drop that one and take this new one with attack up. That's so cool. And then, what else are we doing over here? Looking for a way up there. 
Uh, let's let's attach a bomb. Let me just shoot it. But you know what, you know, Bo. Dang it, you know, Bo. It's not your fault, but come up here. Dang, it hit the treasure chest. Okay. Well, I have the uh, I have this cobble crusher. We'll just go up here. Not a big deal. What? What? No, no. Alright. Oh, that actually worked. <laughs> so we're looking for the booble. We're looking for a treasure. There's a treasure. Where the heck's the booble? Rubber armor. I remember this stuff. I literally don't know where the booble is, though. Well, we got the treasure, which is the main reason we entered, but I mean, I'm also all about the boobles, for reals. Is there any other route to take? If so, I'm not seeing it. There's no, like, map of the caves. There's a map of the depths. There's a, a map of, you know, everything else. But there's not a map uh, of the caves. Any other entrances, exits, things like that? I don't know, man. Oh wait, there's something across there. So wait, is that where I, is that where I came from? No, I, I was up here, I guess. Don't really remember being up there, but it's okay. I mean, there's a booble in every cave, right? Am I misunderstanding? Huh. Well, I hear him. Hear him chirping. So he's definitely in here if I can find him. Oh, wow. Hey, buddy, I see you now. I don't know. Can you shoot that thing like that comes out? I have an idea of how to shoot him if I need to one time. Is this the way out? Is this where we came from? Actually, you know the, you, we know the way out. We all know the way out. The way out is to ascend. Get me out of here. All right. And then uh, there is a shrine. Which way is it? Let's see, is there anything? Surprised I don't see another one of those sign guys. <laughs> Whoa! Oh, the <laughs> He's like, huh? Oh, there's a tree there too. Are you coming this way? I see you. Get out of here. Uh, wasn't there like a big thing here that I was interested in? I see you, tree. I see you. We at least want to get another tower this episode, right? Kind of, oh, there's a, there's a stable.
All right, that was dealt with professionally. Nicely done. And then there's a shrine. Is this? We're nowhere near a fairy, no. There is a stable over here. And a shrine. There's that dragon up there. I don't know what to do about that dragon right now. I don't really remember what we did with dragons in Breath of the Wild. It's been so, so long since I played. I like how there's a shrine near the stables. Touch a cat shrine. If we do one more shrine after this, we'll have another heart, which is really cool to think about. Let's see. Charge attack, yeah. Skip. This is building with logs. See, this is what I mean. Like, it's probably something really simple that we, you know, need to do here. Uh. Easy. All right, what's the secret here? What am I doing? Okay, that, that does fit there, okay. I was worried that wouldn't fit there, but it does. Basically a bridge, right? Oops. Oh, well, yeah, let's do a uh, recall on it. <laughs> Where does this take me? Nailed it. Still got this mirror on my back. Where's the treasure? I already, I already used this. Oh, no, no, not recall. Sorry, alter hand. Because I've already made one, you know, I don't want to waste another one. Yeah, I get it, logs are useful. What do you think is going on over here? Oh, there's a whole bunch of logs. Were those here before? No way these were here before. Where's the treasure, by the way? No way were those logs here before. Now a device that can swim across the lake, but also there's a treasure over there. Okay, easy enough, easy enough, right? Uh, so we're gonna just take, make a new one, I suppose. I did not mean to do that. Okay, here we go. Hey, I can make whatever I want. This is cool. I'm just gonna make the basic raft, I think. Although it gave me a lot of them. Maybe I could make like something awesome. <laughs> Why do you give me so many? Alright, let's not I'm not gonna work I'm not gonna overdo it. there. 
Oh, crap. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> I, didn't mean, I didn't mean to break it. All right, I thought that was going to be way easier than, than that. Let's not do a cobble crusher next time. All right, thankfully we still have... Uh, some one, one of these. I was going to make it all cool and stuff, but wow. Whoa, wait a second. Chill, chill. All right. All right, there you go. Oh, I meant to attach it. Here we go. All right, let's let's do this. <laughs> this destroyed my other one. All right, we're gonna hug the wall here. I could probably just swim to it, honestly. These are really, I mean, for how far we are in this game, some of these, some of these feel extremely basic. Oh, maybe I can't swim there because there seems to be a bit of a current. So let's see what we got. Spiky shield. I don't want that. That's dumb, dude. But I have to take it to, in order to get. Okay, so let's see. Spiky shield. Let's just drop. Uh, I'm gonna drop this one. But I'm also gonna, then going to drop the spiky shield. <laughs> uh, hold on. Spiky shield. Drop. There we go. Great. Come here now. And then we're going to go to the end here. Oh, come on. Okay, there we go. And we've got the treasure, right? Yeah, good. All right. So that's three shrines done. All right. Light of Blessing. Three times three. It's a river between these, this and this next land. We can cross up there. We can get our stable. We can go to the stable. I hear the chirps. So he's investigating. I'm gonna eventually do. I, I'm gonna do this stuff soon. Uh, you know the side quests involving the newspaper stuff. But I want to kind of check in here, see what's going on at the Riverside stable. The ruins ain't that far now. What's up? What are you talking about? Yeah. We met you at Lookout Landing. Good to see a familiar face. Ooh. We're thinking of going to Kakariko Village in the Nakluda region next. That's to the east. This guy's dying to see the ring ruins. Mm. Of course I am. The ring, the ruins ring-like shape is one of a kind. I can't wait to taste, I, I mean, chew them. I, I mean, mm, uh -huh. we've talked about this. Priceless ruins are for seeing, not for eating. Anyway, Kakariko Village is where we're headed. Oh. Kakariko Village is right over there next to that sky view tower. That's not very far. And the ring-shaped rock to the left is probably one of the ring ruins. If you get turned around on your journey, you can take a look at those two things and reorient yourself. <laughs> then why wait? Let's go. Oh. All right, big guy. We're off. See you at the road. All right, see you guys. The ring ruins, huh? All right, so... I need to check in. Oh. All right, Riverside Ooh. Stable, and then one Pony Point, and then I get another reward, which I think is just an, an extra slot for a horse. Oh. oh, it looks like you've got some points saved up, Link. If you want to get your reward, step up to the side counter. Yeah, I know. Uh, I'm, I'm okay right now. Let's just, let's just... 
Oh, hold on. However, since ever since those distinctive ring-shaped Zonai ruins landed there, things have been pretty lively. Talking about Kakariko Village. Sort of a recipe with crabs and something. Let's give a reward. I think it's just another. Uh, it's just another horse oh. slot. I'll be right with you. Thank you. Mm. Pony points. Oh. oh. A traveler's saddle and a traveler's bridle. All right, great. So three more points. I mean, we'll get them because we'll eventually, you know, sleep here or whatever. He's got news on his mind. There's another falling rock. Is there like an island there? Maybe, actually. Take a look at my wares. What's this guy over here doing? My dear, dear wife. Hmm. So if I gather my thoughts, what I know is this. The legendary sword is more than more than fable and far closer to fact. Can it truly defeat any monster? Does it truly exist in Hyrule? Yes and yes, and it's highly likely to be found in the something something woods. Mm -hmm. Huh? Oh, what? Tell me, you, how long have you been there? You didn't happen to overhear what I was just saying, did you? Legendary sword? <laughs> <laughs> well, you heard. I thought as much, but I have nothing to fear. I stand comforted that only the chosen one can wield the legendary sword that defeats any monster. Uh. The chosen one isn't, isn't an eavesdropper. Uh, he is an Eve that is perfectly fine with being dropped in on me, I mean. Uh, and, <laughs> what? <laughs> ah, let me share this openly. Some days ago, I bid farewell to my dear wife, Sorelia, and set out from Lakeside Stable. I find myself now at this stable, but I but the something-something woods that I seek is still far uh, away. So forgive me if I have no more time for eavesdroppers. I have to find the legendary sword to, to protect my dear wife. Uh, All right. Good for you. No sign of him. What are we looking for? Oh. Something isn't right. Aegis and the rest would have would have had to cross the bridge to get here, but what's going on? Oh. oh, I didn't notice you there. Are you a customer? If you're looking for stable services, head over to the counter. I'm waiting here to greet some guests we were expecting, but it's well past when they said they'd be arriving. I'm extremely worried. Oh. They've always crossed the Owlin Bridge in the past when they were coming here. I figured if I kept an eye on the bridge, I'd catch sight of them eventually. The guests are all gourmets. Is that how you say it? Their, their leader, a, ch a chef named Agus, has taught me a lot about cooking. Mm. They were all excited to visit, and I was looking forward to it. They have a recipe from Princess Zelda to share. Hmm, if Agus and the others have tents, then maybe they're taking a trip nice and slow, camping along the way. Still, they haven't shown up yet. I have a bad feeling about this. I don't want to worry too much. There, there is a well, though. Nope. Anything in this well that would be worth it? Let's see. Oh, let's, let's go. Big drop. Thankfully, whoa, hey, this well. Well, oh well, this well, what's up? Water quality, fair, moss growth, extensive, bright caps, present. All right, that's everything, I'll jot it down. Uh? Huh? What are you doing in a place like this? Although, in a place like this, I'm in a place like this. Hey, you wouldn't happen to be a well enthusiast, would you? Yes, I am, uh? of course. I thought so, my name's Fair. I have a deep love of wells, too. Wells are endlessly fascinating. Their damp environment, their unique systems of life, how they stay cool when it's hot outside. Well enthusiasts just get it. The appeal of a good well, that is. What? My dream is to travel around to every single well throughout Hyrule. After scouring all the ancient texts I could find on the subject, I have learned that there are 58 wells. Oh. Sadly, I haven't been able to identify their exact locations, but if you have any interest in wells, then maybe you can help me. Would you tell me any well locations oh. you know of? I'll reward you, of course. How does uh, 10 rupees per location sound? You got a deal. <gasps> Really? That's fantastic. All right, then tell me everything. Well, I've, I don't know how many I found. Ah. Thanks, so eight, uh, eight this time. I'll give you 10 rupees per location. That's 80 rupees total. All yours. <laughs> Thanks for sharing. I'm excited to go visit all of these wells. Let's see. How many left across Hyrule? Oh, there's still a total of 50 to find. Ah. You can find wells all over the place in towns and stables, of course, but even more wells... Uh, those used in the distant past exist within ruins. <laughs> Just imagine, they were a crucial part of life all that time ago. Isn't that simply fascinating? <gasps> oh, I'm going to look out landing next. There's a well there I want to see. So if you learn more well locations, meet me there. See you around. So I have not been in the well in Lookout Landing. That's one thing I forgot to do, as there is a well just kind of standing there. Can I not grab this? There we go. I don't know. I mean, 
the whales are all different. I don't think they all have, like, they're not all gonna have, like, boobles or whatever, right? This is just a neat little well. Oh well. Let's go up. Boom. Hey. Oh, I freaked him out. I freaked him out. These are the guys that will attack you, right? Like, if you attack them, they'll attack you. I'm a little worried. I don't know if I want to do that right now. Alright, so I know there's like a little... I don't know if I should do every single stable, like... I don't know. I was kind of wanting to do all, kind of all in one go, but I mean, that might take a long time. So I've already done one, I think, so maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I should just go and do his little side quest. Let's see what's up, dude. Look at those birds. Ow! I've been hearing some chirps and warbles from my little birds. They say some regular guests at the stable are late to arrive, very late. Mm. The chef here, Goddard, was going to meet with them to learn a new recipe, one that Princess Zelda taught them. It's raining now. The rain is the perfect setting for a prime story. My keen reporter instincts won't let me leave this alone. Goddard has been all has been over there waiting for the guests to arrive. He's barely moved this whole time. Hmm. Let's see. I'm not. It's not unusual for guests to decide not to show up, right? But what if they're unable to? They were coming to share a recipe from Princess Zelda too. Hmm. This could be part ah. of it. These chirps and warbles are worth looking into. So Gourmet's gone missing. So he's looking this way, right? So if I wanted, if they were gonna be going across that bridge, I would go look across this bridge. That's what I would do. At least I think. Wait, is this a different well? No, that's the well I went into. What are you doing here? My dear, dear wife. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, here. I guess I'll go check out the bridge and then, I don't know. I don't know how this works. I don't know what I'm to find. I need to reach my friend. Okay, another one of these. Where's your friend, little buddy? Let's see how far away he is. Man, so far. Oh, geez, I don't have anything. I'll just have to float you down the river. Something happened over there. Oh, it was a sky thing. Oh wow. There's a okay, hold on. Hold on one second. Are there any Okay, let's see what, what I can do. I don't have a vehicle right now. There is a cart. This is the Allen Bridge. Your guy's way over there. My first thought is just to float him down the river, honestly. Oh, there's a guy with a sign. Everything is happening. Uh, let's see. Oh, Hylian Tomatoes. Uh, let's go deliver this guy to where we need to go, I guess. This is like, I mean, I, I don't know. There's, there's got to be a better way to do this, obviously. Also, I'm unsure that I'll be able to, to find the people. I mean, I don't know if they're nearby. They're not on that bridge, obviously. What are we looking at over here? Uh. Oh, we can make a boat. We can sail. I guess. And then try to get over there somehow. 
I mean, we may not even need to sail, honestly. We could just probably push this way out over there. Or hell, hold on. Let me, let me get, let me, let me do it. Let's, let me be on here. I have a Korok, uh, I have a Korok leaf that we could use. Here we go. Great. Uh, and then he's just over here, right? Oh, there's some sort of something over there. A bunch of though. What are those doing here? I don't know. Oh, I forgot all about my battery thing that I wanted to do as well. All right, let's grab this. Rock seeds times two. Yeah. And then, uh, sort of a flag there. What are these guys doing? What's your story? What are you doing? Are you selling flowers? What are you doing? This will toughen you up. What is it? Oh, hello. hello. Do you ever feel frail, feeble, wilted? Even if you don't, an iron shroom might be right for you. Your muscles will bulge, your pecs will swell. That pesky soft skin will grow as hard as nails. <laughs> My pesky soft skin. If you ever thought, I feel pretty safe from monsters except in the whole skin area, then you need an iron shroom. Come take a look. I'm sure you'll... Okay, let's see what, what they have. They got iron shrooms. I, I'm okay. No, I'm good. I'm good. So she's a shroom carrier. Oh, wow. Okay, hold on. So there's like two different, like, here, let's, we got this. Don't worry. All right. Oh, let's, instead of Korok leaves, let's, uh, whoa, he's a spring shield. I have one of those. I have one of those. So my spring shield is... Hold on. Right there. <laughs> Love it. Shocking Mitter Club. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Who else we got? Gust. Get out of here, guys. Who else? Anyone else got something? Got one of them. Oh, wow. There's so much going on here. What the heck? What is this guy doing? I saved you, but now I'm going to fight you, so... You know how it goes. Uh... Oh, wow. Big boy's still here. Oh, ow. Dude, that spike shield hurt me. Which button is dodge? <laughs> Ow. Stupid spike shield. Got him out of the picture. Whoa, 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 buddy. Okay, that hurt. That hurt. Uh, hey, what's your story? Oh, another spike shield. Where did these, I mean, I mean uh, spring shield. Where did these guys get these from? All right, who's left? Is anyone left? Guy in the sky. Not anymore. Cannon shield, beam emitter. Spring shield is pretty cool. Let me go ahead and eat a food. What is this place? Like Is there anything up here? I 
do not know. There is a tower just right up there. That's not very that's not very far. We could go unlock that. What is this? Silent shroom. I don't know what it's gonna take for me to get up there. I don't know what that flag is about either. What are you guys doing? Glad got oh. okay. You must have a lot of energy if you can go all night without a rest. Are you headed this that way too, buddy? Ooh. I'm told there's a massive deep chasm on the other side of uh, Proxim Bridge. From what I hear, it's so deep it goes all the way to the depths of the earth. Mm. Well, it's possible that's an exaggeration, or is that an excavation? Either way, be careful if you go near that chasm. I wouldn't want to fall in. I don't, falling in is, isn't really what worries me. I keep getting sidetracked in this episode. I don't. I don't really know what I'm doing. But there is a tower here. I don't know what it's going to take to activate it, but there is a tower here. And maybe if I activate this one, then I can just make my way over to the next one. But I need to find that traveling crew, and I don't know where they are. I also need to do the sign guy. So much to do. Oh wow. Uh, where are you at? Read you. Come here. <laughs> Dude, that's so funny. Whoa! Oh no! Oh dear, this is one of those moving things. Oh wow, 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 wow. That hit anybody? Not yet. There you go. This is a battle talus. That's so cool. Oh, wow. Let's go again. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. That one died. This one, my, my attack's up, but I mean, like, I kind of want to save that for something special. There you go. He's having a hard time, isn't he? I think I can climb up here. And then, uh, oh wow. Uh, and then, hold on, where, uh, hold on. Cobble, oh, no, let's use this. I got, I, I made one of these specifically for stuff like this. Whoa, oh God. What happened there? What the heck was that? Okay, Reju, where are you at? Uh, oh boy. Oh wow, oh wow. Oh wow. Uh, where's Riju? Okay, so this is gonna be really interesting. Whoa, that almost hit me. That's a good hit. Can I just get over there? No. I did nothing. Okay, here. Actually, can I. Let's go ascend. Can I not ascend on this guy? This is a perfect spot. Go, go. <laughs> Perfect. Here we go. He's done for. That's my first battle, Talus. Pretty cool fight. Whoa, what is this? Oh, you know what? That's going to be... Uh, if I take... Uh, like... What about a spear? Do you think a spear would be awesome with that? Let's see. That's a pretty cool little spear. It's got a heart on the end. Well, that was awesome. Uh, now, to get over here, it seems straightforward. Oh, wow, more stuff. Good, good, good. Okay, well, great. No, the guts. Come here, guts. <laughs> uh, this is quite the climb. I think I can just walk up this way, though. Like, like basically walk up. 
Yeah. Now, I don't know if there's going to be any sort of challenge once I get over here. Like, once I'm here, then, then what happens? I don't know. I mean, this is, might be a straightforward activation. Poplar Foothills Skyview Tower. This might just be it. This might be exactly what I need. Is this a well? That's a well. Now, is that all she they needed? Let me go in the well first. Since I'm here. Since I'm here. I don't know if I have to go in for it to be properly identified or whatever, but... How'd that not work? Here, I have, uh, I have a cobble, whatever. I have this, too. Iron box hammer. But I have a, specifically, a cobble crusher here. Who was asking for help? What the heck? This is like a prison. Whoa. What the heck? Oh. Y you, what are you doing in a place like this? No, no, it doesn't matter. Could you just help me? What's what's wow? What's wrong? <laughs> I set off a trap in the ruins and now I'm stuck. Oh, what a mess. How do I do this? Can you see a switch? If you press that, you should be able to get me out of this. There's a cave entrance over there. I got I got in that way. I'm begging you, mister. It'll just I'll just be waiting here trusting you. Wow, uh, okay. I'm gonna activate the tower and then hope I don't forget about this guy. <laughs> here, well, let me just, here, ascend. So there's a cave entrance somewhere to rescue this guy. Also smoke over there. So if I activate this, I need to come back down. Actually, I don't have to use it. That's the thing, I don't have to use it. I can just activate it. Oh, it's broken. Uh, okay. So the cave entrance is, where, where do you think the cave entrance? I don't even have a map of it. Oh, that's his. All right, so I have to do this now, probably. Oh, wow, look at that. What the heck is that? Where's the cave entrance? I really don't know where this cave entrance is. Oh, there we go. Probably related to this. There's a well over here too. There's also a cave entrance. Glide, what the heck, dude? How can I glide, whoa. What's this little town doing here? Where's, uh, where's Riju? Riju, we have a situation on our this is great. This is great. We can do this. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so this is basically going to be like a cave rescue that we do. Whoa. <laughs> scare me every time. Where'd my hearts go? Oh, there's a jail over there. Okay. Discovery. Foothills excavation sites. Not just a cave. It's an excavation. Excavation. All right. So, yeah. There's some stuff going on here. Let's let's do it. Oh, wow. Look at all these, though. First up, we'll look at these. So, we're nowhere near Hateno. There you go. Thank you. I knew you'd rescue me. I don't have much, but please take this purple ruby. But what about? Can you? Can you just? Th th that is what lured me into this trap. I don't even want to look at it anymore. Do whatever you want with it. Wait. I don't have time to chat. I have urgent business at the tower, so I have to go. Thanks again. So yeah, he's gonna be the one who helps me at the tower. So he already got that. What about over here? What's the story with this one? Uh, no, I don't want to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pr 
perfect. Now, I thought there would be a booble here, but I don't know if this is a real cave or what. I don't know. Topaz. Is there... Oh, wait. Look at this. There's always a booble. Never forget it. So here's my idea. I have an idea on how to take the care, ter, care of this guy, by the way. Someone get him, quick. Someone else, everyone can shoot him, right? I don't have to be the only one. Shoot him. Someone shoot him. Do I have to be the one to pull the trigger here? Okay, well, hold on, let me think about this. First up, let me go ahead and eat a little bit, just because I don't know. Um, okay, okay, yeah. So here's my idea. All right, watch this, watch this. Did I get him? Oh, dang, dude. I was trying to just get, ah, oh, I thought I could get him. Where's my thing, did it break? Dude, did I throw that spear and it broke? Oh no. I love that spear. Is that what happened? Okay, well I have a new a new spear. That's pretty cool. Sort of. It's only 19. Whatever. Dang. I don't know if they do they always break when you do that? I don't even know. There's another well here, by the way. And then, uh, let me go check out this well, and then I'll be, uh, I'll ascend back up to the tower. Such a nice little area. I don't, I don't remember what this used to be in Breath of the Wild. Pop of Foothills, South Well. Ow. What if I could have taken fall damage there. I'm glad I didn't. Oh, nice, these guys. Well, here's the other thing. I don't know if I'll... What is this? The road of a gourmand is fraught with thorns. That's why I chose to choose to travel alone. But this life does have a share of lonely nights. That's when you need to shine a light to keep the darkness at bay. These newly discovered bright ingredients have the strange effect of making the body glow. I recently discovered that the intensity of the light changes depending on the materials you use. For instance, when I ate a dish cooked with a glowing cave fish, I produced more light than I did after my bright cap dish. I wonder if the effect is more powerful the harder the ingredient is to collect. Or could the quantity of each material play a part somehow? I clearly have more experimenting to do. There is no shame in not knowing, for beyond what lies the joy of knowing. Tonight, uh, I am the candlelight, the lonely cook, Chef Ori Tamu. Good to know. So this is yet another, you know, well that I've been to. And then if we want to activate the tower, which I do. So you cook with these fish. These fish will light you up big. Let's cook like, like five of these. Do you think I'll get like a big light? I don't know. Like an elixir maybe? I don't know. Oh yeah, so I need to I need to go up. I need to send. Perfect. Exit. And then we'll go back into this cave and do the same thing. And ascend. And let's see. Can I just take this, like... That, that is heavy enough. Good. I was gonna say I, I could trap myself in here, but I don't think I can really, because I can always ascend out. Anyway, business at the tower. Let's see what kind of business this guy has. Oh. 
Do you think he's working on it? Hello again. Oh. Hello there, mister. Thanks again. I was only in the area in the first place to do maintenance on the tower. The terminal wasn't making anything happen due, due to the humidity, but I fixed it in a jiffy. Mm. Unfortunately, getting stuck caused all the kinds of delays. I need to hurry to the next Skyview Tower. I probably caused trouble for my friends at the construction company, so I'm going to get moving as soon as I calm down. <laughs> so we activate this. This will be good because I'll actually have a new area unlocked. I have no idea where those travelers are or whatever. So much sky stuff to do. Look at all that stuff in the sky. What do we even do? Let's go take a look. Here we go. Boom! Up very high. Now there's storms surrounding some of these. I, I imagine I might need some sort of lightning thing to deal with those, maybe. There's a whirlpool down there. There's so much to do. So much to do. I don't think we're very far from the other tower, honestly. So there we go. We got that done. There's Lake Hylia. Fair enough. I think there is a... Uh, dude, I think there is a stable down here that I need to get. Unless I'm misremembering. And what the heck is that? Sky map up to sky map looks crazy. Uh okay, so Lake Hylia, obviously, yes. I'm gonna just kind of Wow. That's a big bridge. Okay, let, let's let's glide for a second. I don't know what the heck I'm looking for. Can I just drop? I haven't dropped into one of these yet. I don't know what these these are. What is this? It's etched with ancient Hyrulean text you cannot read. <clears throat> All right. Well. <laughs> Good to know. Uh, looking for stables. It's so foggy. anyone see any stables? I remember that. That's like the temple of time, right? My knowledge on the, the map is not great. Like Hylia. Which way is... Now let's go to the regular map. Fair and grasslands. Fenra woods. There's a lot of woods. If there's a if there's a stable over there, that might be the one I need to get the musician to get a fairy. Take a look over here. There would be a the easy way to find a stable is there would there would be a shrine next to it, so if I don't see any shrines, then then what? Huh. Hmm. You know, I haven't seen any Lynels this game. But I'm pretty sure they're in the game. I don't know what I'm looking for. It's a whirlpool. There's who knows what. Where's the other... Uh, there is another tower that we could get. It's way over there. Huh. Can it, where is the... Uh, where's the stable that I saw earlier? Because we need... There's a bridge... 
Was it over here? See, there's the stable I was just at, I think. And they were worried about a bridge or something. Yeah, there's the bridge. And there's a sign guy over there. So we could just go over here. Um, can't see anything up here, really. It's so foggy. Really, they should just remove the fog. I'm also going to have to be looking for the glyph soon, you know? It's like so much to do in this game. But it's fun. I'm not, that's not a complaint, really. It's just like me saying, yeah, there's a lot to do. Don't I know it. I don't know if those travelers would be lost in the woods over here or what. Still a little bit of fall damage because I overdid it myself. Splash fruits. Alright, let's get over here. Stamina doesn't feel as important in this game, mostly because I can just build vehicles. But still I find the need to like try to swim it out sometimes, you know? If I'm gonna help that guy with the shrine, by the, with the with the sign, by the way, I need to maybe bring some gear. There's some wood and stuff over here. I might just just pack it all up. Wait, that was that the bridge, or was, I thought the bridge was up over here. No, that was the bridge. All right, let me uh let me just bring a few things. Sign guys, the heck was that? Oh, an Octorok. Okay, <laughs> that always throws me off. I'm like, who who just attacked me? I'm gonna check in this forest to see if they're in there. They may not, they may be in there. They may not be in there. This is kind of one of those like episodes where I'm not quite sure what I'm doing. All right, this sign looks weird as heck, dude. What the heck? You have my support. I don't know if I brought enough stuff. <laughs> Just let it go. Just see what happens. I'm curious how this falls. Try letting go. Yeah, I'm not gonna catch it. Nope. It was worse than ever. Unforgivable. I think I might need like a... I think I know what I, I need to build, actually. Let's see. This would be interesting. Hold on one second. Let's 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 build it, maybe. This would be really interesting. Kind of a three-prong device, maybe? I don't know. Maybe. So maybe something kind of like uh, one over here. One like over here, maybe? I mean, that's not gonna work. <laughs> There's no way it's gonna work. All right, I just want to see what happens though. Try letting go. Sure, yeah. It's up. It's still up. Wow. <laughs> All right, so it fell that way, which is interesting because that means I can maybe move uh, move this back a little bit, maybe. Like maybe uh, move it up and over here. 
and then uh, right there, maybe. Now see about it. Try letting go. It's still up. <laughs> it swung. All right, all right. So I have some ideas still. Oh, jeez. The problem with this. Oh, that didn't even hold. I don't quite know. That might hold. Wow. A miracle. Here we go. That was brilliant. I never would have thought of it. All right. Let's get him secured while he's still standing. All right. Great. Good job. Perfect. With your help, President Hudson is now standing proudly and firmly in place. It fills my heart with joy to see him doing so well on his own. Take this with my thanks. Red rupees. I'm doing good on rupees, I think. Oh, a nice stealth up. That's, you know, I forgot stealth was even a thing in this game, but I do remember now. All right. So here's the thing. I don't know where in the world. You know, they're supposed to come across this bridge. Does it mean they're on the other side? They're on this side? I don't know. And because if they're going to cross this bridge, they would come over here. I see these guys. I don't think they're like prisoners or anything here, are they? But I can see them like being kind of lost in the forest. But the main thing is I don't actually know where they are at all. I'll go take a peek in here. I don't know. If they're in here, great. But they're talking about like camping, right? Camping gear and stuff like that. Hey, buddy. Yeah, there's uh, there's some camping stuff up here. Great. So this, I mean, this might be a super easy little mission. And then the newspapers will be updated with my heroics. Although I think the latest news was all about my heroics too, so. Hey guys, the pain. Aww. Oh, help please, it's Agus Princess. Uh, her recipe is written. Don't, don't improvise. What is her recipe as written is meat and rice bowl. Raw meat, Hylian rice, rock salt. I don't think I have any Hylian rice. Uh, this flavorful, comforting dish is sure to fill your energy. Be sure to follow the recipe to the letter. I think animal meat, right? Maybe, uh, I don't think I have Hylian rice. Everyone's sick. Uh. Always follow the recipe. I'm gonna check. I don't think I have Hylian rice, but maybe I do have Hylian rice. Let's sort it by the alphabet. Let's see. All right, we, we can't, <laughs> we can't. Okay, highly. I don't think I have Hylian rice. I know some's for sale. Is this it? This Hyrule herb. The bantha wheat. I don't think I have Hylian rice. Well, I found him. I just need some rice. And I don't know where I get some rice. Yeah, it's probably for sale at like one of the landings or something, you know? Let me go. What is that sound? Just looking to see if there is if it's here. Oh god. Uh here, you know what? Let's travel. I don't know if it's gonna be for sale at the uh lookout landing, but it might be. 
because I need to make it. I need to cook it. As said, it's like raw meat, Hylian rice, rock salt, right? Does it matter what kind of raw meat? I have a lot of raw meat. But this is my base of operations, so let's just go over here and see what we got. Look out, landing Skyview Tower, baby. And we will see. Well, first up, I haven't been in this well, and she might be down there now. She said she was going there. But I don't know what this well has in store for us. There she is. This well might be really big. All right. Hey, it's you. I'm fascinated by the many old wells across Hyrule, but new wells are pretty interesting too, like this one. Oh, have you come to tell me about the location of more wells? I got more for you. I think I got like two more, one more. Thanks, so three of them this time. Really, three. I don't remember going to three wells since last time I was there. There's still 47 to find though, so. Did she say there's hidden wells? I don't like that. <laughs> I'm a little worried that I'll break this open and be on like a huge adventure. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like I'll just be like suddenly on a huge adventure. When really, I, just, we're, I don't even know where Unobo is. Here, let me uh, go over here. We'll equip a bomb. Yeah, dude. We can duck. Oh, there's a treasure. A royal claymore is a pretty good treasure. And then there's... Where is this? So let's see if I ascend up. Oh. Oh. That's where I am right there. Oh, wait, is there another treasure there? That's the one I just got. Dude, I didn't even look down there before. I didn't know there was a treasure there. Well, let's uh, let's take a quick nap, and then I will. Uh, I hope they have Hylian rice here for sale. If they don't, I don't remember who sells Hylian rice. So it might just be a something for another time. I don't know. Are the wells gonna be checked off on my list? Like, if I look at my map, are they gonna be like like? I hope they're checked. They're not. Well, that's annoying. You would really want them to be checked off. <laughs> you would really want those wells to be checked, right? Oh, man. Exactly. Exactly what I wanted. Man, how are we going to keep track of all the wells? This sucks. Or maybe maybe they're there. Maybe if uh, I... S okay, maybe, maybe just their existence on the map means I got them. All right. I don't know. I don't know the answer to that. Tell me of Hylian rice. Where am I? I'm all twisted around. Is that rice? Yes. I need some of this. I'll buy them all. I'll buy. And then here's the thing. Well, well, hold on. What, are, what all are we selling over here? Hylian trousers. Hylian tunic. Hylian hood. Snow quill tunic. Uh, flame breaker armor. That's cool. But as I said, uh, we're going to go over here. Uh, over here. I could go here, but I don't know. That's not really... Let's travel there. Because now we know where they are. I bought three in case I mess up the recipe. But I hope I don't mess up the recipe. <laughs> and after we do this, we'll probably end the episode. I don't... Every time I make an episode, I'm trying to figure out, like, well, what was the point of this episode? 
And honestly, I don't know. I mean, we got another tower. Oh, jeez. How do I get over there? Is there a way to quickly and easily get over there? Wait, auto build. Hold on. No, none of those. There's, okay. How, how deep does the history go? <laughs> the history goes pretty far. Hold on, I can just make this. <laughs> it cost me 12. All right, this is this is so lame, but okay. <laughs> it's built, right? Why is it all green? Is it to show me that I built it? Huh. Burn down the forest. All right. Cool. Oh, jeez. All right, there's the camp right up here. Now, that was a huge, you know, expense, but whatever. So the recipe is... Meat and rice bowl, raw meat, Hylian rice, and rock salt. Raw meat, Hylian rice, and rock salt. So we hold it, we'll hold it. Raw meat, which is what? Does it matter? Raw meat, great. Hylian rice. And we'll find rock salt somewhere. There it is. There you go. We're making a good dish. Meat and rice bowl. Classic. And it's salted, too. So I made it. Now what? Oh, help. Please. Don't improvise. There you go. There you go, buddy. Share it. Share it with everyone. <laughs> huh? Th that smell. Uh? Hey, hey, you. Yeah, you. Can I have that meat and rice bowl? Please, please. I need to eat it. Sure, you can have it. Uh -huh. This. I recognize this flavor. <laughs> this is the recipe Princess Zelda shared with us. Joe, Telly, and Dai, hurry up and take a bite of this. I'm the <laughs> chef now. Oh, thank you for helping us. We were not doing so well at all. Princess Zelda taught us how to cook this dish quite some time ago. We ran into her once during our travels. She was full of kindness for us, despite our group being a little ragged on the road. Mm. But I do remember now that she said we needed to follow the recipe exactly. <laughs> uh, those bright eye Whose bright idea was it to substitute monster parts in place of real meat? Oh, who did that? Uh. That was me. I'm sorry. I just was curious what it would taste like. I thought maybe your recipe would work well with monster parts. <laughs> <laughs> the road to gourmet greatness is littered with stuff you wouldn't think is tasty. Gotta expand your palate. Oh. Now's not the time to sit and figure out best practices for future dietary exploits. We've got to get to Riverside Stable. We're so late. I'm sure Goddard has been worrying about us. Ah. We really are grateful for your help. Let me say again, on behalf of everyone, thank you. You don't even know us, but you use valuable ingredients to save us from ourselves. Here, please take this. I got a Hylian rice back. Thank you. And this. It rocks. Okay, I got... Okay. <laughs> and finally... raw. Oh, that's raw... I didn't even use the gourmet stuff. I just used the raw meat. <laughs> we like cooking with the very best raw meat when we have it. You can use all of that to cook yourself a meat and rice bowl sometime. Anyway, we better get ready and head to Riverside Stable since we plan to be there. Well, before uh. now. I have to get going. Hopefully, we'll run into each other in the future. So they... Well, if it isn't my partner... There we go, Pin. Ah. Any luck finding those missing travelers yet? I'm st I'm starting to I'm just starting to scout for them from the sky when I saw you down here. You chased down any leads at all? Oh. What? They were right here, too queasy to even move, and you helped them get back on their feet again? Yee. Interesting. So the chirps and warbles were really onto something. I'm impressed that Ze Princess Zelda's vast knowledge includes things I wouldn't expect, like recipes for dishes. Mm. 
We've worked together to chase two of the story related the stories relating to Z Princess Zelda. Go on and add this to your nest egg, partner. Purple rupees. Good, good, good. Oh, and there's also this. It's from Tracy. Lucky Clover Gazette Fabric. Nice. So, Atino Village's dye shop in Nakluta has started up a new service. It has something to do with fabrics. I know, I know. I'm basically giving you an extra job by handing over this fabric. But still, the point is that by accepting and making use of it, you can show that you're officially part of the Lucky Clover Gazette. Mm. It would be nice if Tracy handled things a bit more simply, though. Anyway, that's all done. It's always great working with you, partner. A recipe from Princess Zelda, perfect for getting folks into fighting shape. Ah, uh, the article almost writes itself. Ah. Almost. Soar long. All right, great. Gourmet's Gone Missing Side Adventure complete, guys. And it's been a long episode. I was hoping to get a little more achieved, but we had a lot of fun. So it's been a long one. I will actually want to look over here really quick. <laughs> Oh, well, how did I, why did I drop? So I will be seeing you guys next time for more. It's probably too slippery to get up here, right? Probably so. So we won't worry about it right now. But hold on, something's falling down. Maybe I can land on it. Where's that gonna land? Oh, it's gonna land way over here. Oh well, let's not worry too much about it. Thank you for watching. Come back next time. Well, hold on, let me. Maybe I will worry about it just a little bit. Just a little tad. Let's use recall on this. Jump up into the sky. Here's some nonsense. And then I want to. I want to see about landing on top of that. It's really fast. So foggy too. There is something up there. I. I my guess was gonna be like a Korok, but maybe it's something more. What is up there? No, 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 no gust, no gust. Well, I, why is this taking me so long? Oh, you know what this is probably for? Do I, do, do I, do I gotta follow that? There we go. Cool. <laughs> you found me. All right. I think I did the right thing. Bye-bye. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help the channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thank you so much for watching. You can now join on YouTube and become an official member of Zach Scott Games. And if you want cool shirts like this, visit ZachScott.shop. Come back next time for more.